Yeah. I want to discuss the well again. Oh, I see. An opportunity to use the well may not even arise. I understand this. All I meant to suggest is that if it does, I be the one to do so. I am willing to accept the consequences. What if something happens to you? What about your son? Kieran is... a strong lad. He will thrive. With or without me. Are you sure of that? <laughs> I am sure of precious little these days. Yes? More rituals? What are they for, do you know? I believe they signify an intent to lay oneself bare, to champion a cause without pity, regret, or shame. Mathal's cult was not fond of vacillation. One approached them with nothing less than complete confidence. What happened to those who were less sure of themselves? Legend does not say. Perhaps this place has a more gruesome history than we know. Do you know what this part of the temple was used for? It may have served as a chamber of reflection. Perhaps to contemplate the righteousness of one's cause. More importantly, I suspect none were permitted beyond this area without a priest. Ancient texts claim Mathal passed judgment in the flesh, but was surely the priests who proclaimed rulings here. Why did the ancient elves insist on so many rites? We may safely assume one did not petition high priests for Mathal's justice by strolling up and knocking. I see no more insufferable ceremony here than in a chantry. Let's continue. As you wish.